Sometimes you're gonna build something and it's perfect right out of the gate. Sometimes you hate it. And that happens and it doesn't make you a bad DIYer and it doesn't make you a bad florist. Sometimes I will fight with a bouquet for 45 minutes and I've been doing it for years and that's just the kind of day it is. But what I wanna urge you is not to scrap the bouquet and start all over. Because every time you take a bouquet apart, you're weakening your product and you're overworking your product. I have a different idea. So I built this in a spiral method. This isn't any shape that I'm wanting. I you know, tried adjusting it and I can't get it to like something that I'm inspired by or something I'm happy with. So what I'm gonna do is I've, I've bound it with rubber bands so it's supported. Then I loosen my grip and I take this hand and I come in and I just rock its world. I make the front the back, the back the front. I don't care at this point because I'm frustrated and I need something different. So I just come in and when I shift these around, I know that I'm not hurting my product because all of these stems are in a safe place because they've been built in a spiral method. And all of a sudden, I, it's very obvious that this has changed and I've done hardly anything except shake it. I have more air in this, I wanted more asymmetry, and I got it with that little tweak rather than getting frustrated and scrapping the whole thing. Now I might need to go back and change a few placements, but that's way easier than starting over. You'll be way less frustrated and you won't damage your product.